just take six. Seven, I think. Is this so take seven? This is take six and a half, we'll go with. Take six and a half. Hello, and welcome to the FSW campus. We're here today to talk to you about a few things that will help you academically and professionally. Today, we'll be talking about budgeting, t -t time management, <laughs> professional skill building, and sleep. The stress of money weighs hard on everyone. Luckily, there is a way to help reduce the stress of this with one easy method, budgeting. Budgeting is a way to keep you in control of your money spending. Now this isn't a simple overnight fix, but something that takes time and dedication to get right. A budget will help keep you on track of how you're spending your money, along with making sure that you are achieving financial goals. When creating a budget, start by writing down all your monthly expenses. This includes trips to Dunkin', clothing shopping, and recurring monthly bills. Anything that you spend money on, even if it's a dollar, track it! This will give you a start of where you're overspending and where you need to save. You can keep track by an Excel spreadsheet, a budget book, or even envelopes. Now that you're keeping track, it's time to set some goals. These goals may be putting so much money into savings each month or paying off a debt within a certain time frame. Don't be afraid to make adjustments as needed. As stated before, this is something that takes time. Your budget will be ever-changing just like you. Now that you know some knowledge about budgeting, let's move on to our next topic. Time in. There is a lot of free time in college, and with that comes the challenge of balancing free time with study time. Identifying your management style, creating a schedule, and getting better at prioritizing is key components in helping you balance your time better. Think about what is important that you want to keep track of. Perhaps you want a daily calendar that breaks down all of your school assignments, or maybe you just want to log in upcoming deadlines. Whatever you decide, note that there are many tools to help assist with helping keep track from a dry board, a cloud-based calendar, or a planner. There are also many distractions that can occur when trying to create a balanced study time, procrastination being the main problem. But remember, little things that can help combat this. Have a space that you go to just to study. Turn off any electronics that may move your attention from your work and keep studying bite-sized. If you take your time to study and learn the material, you can break down your study time to 30 and 40 minutes daily versus cramming all the information in in one night. Professional skill building can help you succeed academically because you need to have great communication skills with your classmates and professors. If you're like me and you're interested in the healthcare field, this will help you succeed because you have to communicate with your patients and your peers. You also want to have a positive attitude and build relationships with others. Sleep schedule is important for someone professional and academically because sleep helps your brain function at its best. Seven hours of sleep is usually good for an adult. A good night's sleep involves four to five cycles of REM sleeping or rapid eye movement. Lack of sleep can impair your level of reasoning and thinking. You're less productive at work and school, and lack of sleep can affect your mood and how you interact with others. It can also increase risk of heart disease and infections. Sleep benefits you by helping you think more clearly, have quicker reflexes, and focus better at work and in school. All of this brought to you by Professor Lampos' Cornerstone class. Woo! Rolling. Go for it. Take four. You have options by creating a self spreadsheet that spends that swap. Take five. Time. I messed up. <laughs> Just keep going. I'm supposed to be here. Okay. Have to have positive attitude and build relationships. My arm hurts. <laughs> this is terrible. My arm is killing me too, but yeah. Ma! 
take three. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> okay. It's not ready. My bad, she ain't ready. Give me your high five, say keeps. I'm gonna go restart it. <laughs>